Okay, I found the best way to swap out the belts on these motors is to start off by loosening up the nuts on the wheels so they float. Take nut driver or whatever other tool you have and you're gonna remove the four screws that hold the silver bracket plate down to the blue plate. With the four nuts taken off, you can take the motor plate completely off. You can see the, the gear underneath and you have your belt. Now, what you wanna do is take the new belt, you're gonna wrap it around the cog. You can put the screws back in the place or just leave them. Make sure that the belt goes in between the two white bushings here. And I like to just put the nuts back on just loosely enough that you can still move the, the whole bracket around, but you can still not have things pop off. Let's see if I can get this last guy on here. The one under the motor can be a little tricky sometimes. All right, but anyway, so what you're gonna do is at this point, take the belt, wrap it around the wheels, fit them into the slot. Now you'll see that the bracket's probably pretty close to the bottom of the slots. If you take and pull down, so you see a little bit of blue underneath, you should have some little rings on there. The important thing is it should start making the wheels bend inward. And if you try to push them flat, you'll see it moves the bracket up. So put them down, retighten. Make sure you have about an even amount of blue showing on either side. Get this last guy on. The last one you'll have to use a screwdriver to tighten. Unless you have a little socket or a little uh, crescent wrench you get in there. Make sure they're all nice and tight. And then the last step is you're gonna tighten down the wheels and this is where you're gonna get your tension. So once, you'll see as I get the one wheel tight, the other wheel is, is definitely rockered. And if you get that bolted down, And you may need to use a screwdriver on that too. Get those nice and tight. And with that, you have nice tension on the belt. You should have the belt going in between the bushings in there and you should be good to go.